In this video, we're talking about what it means to exceed the national quality standard and what that looks like in terms of practice. So can you tell us why the assessment and rating of the exceeding national quality standard has changed? This assessment and rating change was part of the review of the 2012 national quality standard and the development of the 2018 NQS. This is one of a number of changes which aim to strengthen quality through greater clarity. A rating of exceeding national quality standard means going above and beyond what is expected at the meeting national quality standard for a standard. And the new exceeding NQS guidance clarifies the requirements and expectations between the meeting national quality standard and the exceeding national quality standard rating levels for each of the 15 standards under the new 2018 NQS. Sector feedback suggested that more information was needed to clarify what above and beyond means and to better explain expectations of quality at the exceeding national quality standard rating level. So how is the new exceeding national quality standard guidance developed? A number of key sources were consulted in the development of the guidance. These included the existing exceeding national quality standard guidance, a review of some of the examples of current exceeding national quality standard practice, as well as discussions with sector experts. And we drew on the views of experienced authorised officers about what differentiates meeting and exceeding national quality standard practice. Feedback on the draft exceeding NQS guidance was also received from jurisdictions and key stakeholders. The result is a comprehensive set of guidance and support resources for providers, services and assessors. So what are the headlines changes to the assessment and rating of exceeding NQS? To achieve a rating of exceeding NQS for any standard, the three exceeding NQS themes need to be demonstrated in service practice for that standard. So in addition to meeting the requirements of the NQS standard, practice for that standard needs to be embedded in service operations, informed by critical reflection, and shaped by meaningful engagement with families and or the community. Authorised officers will seek evidence of the three exceeding national quality standard themes being evident in practice. The authorised officers will use the observe, the discuss and cite evidence gathering methods to collect evidence about service quality. Authorised officers will then consider all the evidence collected to determine a services quality rating. All of the standards in the quality area must also be rated as exceeding national quality standard for that quality area to now be rated as exceeding national quality standard. Can you unpack the three exceeding national quality standard themes for us? The first of the exceeding NQS themes is practices embedded in service operations. And by embedded, we mean that this is usual everyday practice for the specific standard. It's high quality practice for the standard and it's demonstrated consistently and frequently across the service. It's understood by all and evident in many ways, both visibly and invisibly across all the staff and all the services practices, systems and operations. Therefore, this is not practice that is demonstrated only by some of the service staff and educators or not evident across the whole service, or not consistently delivered throughout the year. Embedded practice creates a stable and high quality service environment that benefits children, families, and the service community. Consistency in intent and approach to practice creates a sense of continuity, predictability, and security for each child, which we know is critical for belonging, being, and becoming. Consistency in intent reflects deep understanding of the why and how of practice. Exceeding NQS theme too relates to practice being informed by critical reflection. And critical reflection means continually thinking about, questioning, analysing and re-evaluating practice to identify where further improvements could be made for educators, children and families. Critical reflection is essential to our daily work, but it can be challenging for some services and educators. It is consistently in the top five NQS elements that are not met. At the exceeding NQS level for this theme, 
there is ongoing critical reflection by members of the team, both as individuals and collectively as a team. This is evident when they ask why and how questions of themselves and each other, when they consider theoretical underpinnings of their actions and decisions, when they seek alternative views and opinions and explore possibilities, when they draw on various sources of knowledge and research evidence, and when they consider new practices and assess if they align with the services philosophy and with the approved learning frameworks. Exceeding National Quality Standard Theme 3 relates to practice being shaped by meaningful engagement with families and the community. It's important to remember that each of the more than 15,600 approved services in Australia has a unique geographical, cultural and community context. No one service is identical to another and each service evolves over time as the children and families attending the service and the staff and teams working at the service change, develop and also evolve. We know that when practice is tailored and responsive and children see connections between home and their education and care service and they experience continuity, they are more likely to be involved and confident learners. This culture of inclusiveness also enhances families' sense of belonging and children's sense of identity. At the exceeding NQS level for all standards, services welcome, respect, draw on the voices, priority and strengths of the children and families at the service. Practice is suited to and draws inspiration from its unique geographical, cultural and community context. Opportunities for collaboration with family and community members are central to the service's approach to their practice for the standard and practice is informed by meaningful and ongoing partnerships. To support services and educators understand the exceeding national quality standard changes, ASEQA has developed a suite of resources, including the new 2018 Guide to the National Quality Framework, which includes guidance on the three themes and tailored indicators for each of the 15 standards. The ASEQA website is the portal for all of our resources and we encourage services and educators to subscribe to our newsletter and blog and to follow us on social media. Documentation is such an important part of professional practice. Let's unpack it in more detail in the next video.